Recently, the pro-NASA propagandists within the YouTube community were asked 32 questions. A lot of these questions remain unanswered, and I plan on addressing the responses in depth later. But for now, there is one particular response that I would like to comment on. The Big 32 was, Dr. Q Zeng believes the Chinese Shenzhou 7 spacewalk videos are fake. As an engineer at NASA's Jet Propulsion Lab, is he qualified enough to speak authoritatively on this subject? Dr. Zeng had made an appearance in the Epic Times in which he stated these views. Just to confirm that this was indeed a true representation of his beliefs, I sent him an email asking him for verification, which he gladly sent. On the morning of March 28, 2010, I awoke to find that YouTube user gone to Plaid had posted the following message two days earlier. Websites such as Ollis, Above Top Secret, and The Epic Times keep throwing the name Dr. Q Zeng around and claim to have talked to him. The problem is that an internet search of any listing of Q Zeng and JPL, or Jet Propulsion Laboratory, turns up nothing. Jarrah claims to have personally talked to Zeng. I think Jarrah is blatantly lying. I am quite shocked and appalled by this accusation, because three days prior to posting this message, Gone to Plaid asked me to supply him with Dr. Zeng's contact details, which I happily sent to him over PM. And just so that there is no doubt that I indeed contacted Dr. Zeng through his jpl.nasa.gov email address, let's look at our communications. I had asked the good doctor, Dr. Q Zeng, it says in the October 19th, 2009 release of the Epic Times that you believe the telecasts of the first Chinese spacewalk were faked. Can you please confirm that this is indeed your true stance along these lines? To which he replied, Yes. I further found the geographic features shown in the real-time broadcast in the partial Earth image actually did not match with what you should see at the time according to orbit computation. Thanks for the inquiry. Signed, Zeng. So tell us, Gone to Plaid, why would you claim not being able to find Zeng's contact details and blatantly accuse me of lying when just three days earlier I gave you Zeng's jpl.nasa.gov email address at your request. And how can you claim an internet search of any listing of Q Zeng and JPL turns up nothing when all one needs do is punch Q Zeng at JPL into Google and pull open the fourth result? I'm sure we'd all love to know.